It's October 21st. Usually by this time of the uh, by this time of the year, we have harvested everything. But um, I'm just now checking Shea Vineyard. Uh, about half of our fruit is in, and uh, this is this is what extreme viticulture looks like. You can see um, what we call cluster sovereignty. There's no cluster touching another. I'm down to one cluster per shoot and we've pulled leaves on both sides so that you get plenty of airflow and that cuts down on botrytis. What it doesn't cut down on is uh, birds who have very good eyesight seeing your fruit. We don't have too much bird damage but you can kind of see the little places here and here where the berries have been picked away. The birds must have some kind of infrared vision because as soon as the fruit is ready to be picked for wine, about two days before that, they start pecking at it. So we're very close. Um, I'm going to let this hang maybe one more week. The, uh, the forecast here in Oregon is for next week to be sunny but cool. We may take a little bit of um, rain, trace amounts over the weekend, but hey, we're Oregonians and we don't feel comfortable unless our fruit is properly washed before we vinify it. So, thanks for uh, taking a walk with me in Shea Vineyard. Ciao.